is up guys? It's me, Alicia. I posted a video about a month ago saying that I was going to continue making YouTube videos, but I did need some time to just figure things out, figure myself out, and I think I'm finally ready to get back into making videos. I never made a 50 facts about me, but I did do a couple of facts about me videos. I think maybe like 20 facts but I compiled a list of 50 facts about myself. A lot of the facts in my old videos are old. Um, people change, <laughs> I've changed, so. so I'm just gonna get started. So first thing I'll start off with is my name. My full name is Alicia Faith Lucas, so that's where I get Alicia Faith from. My middle name is Faith, and my last name is Lucas. I'm 21 years old. I think last time that I posted a Facts About Me video, I was 16 or 17, so it's been a while. My birthday is November 14th, so I just turned 21, fresh. <laughs> I was born and raised in San Jose, California. I am a Scorpio, so watch out. One thing a lot of people don't know about me, some people do, is that I love anime. Um, I went through a huge phase in middle school. I actually went to an anime convention with my friends when I was in middle school called Fanime. Since there were, I think, three days of the convention, I cosplayed three times, three different characters. Misa Amane from Death Note, Orihime from Bleach, and Luca from um, Vocaloid. My favorite shows are Parks and Rec, The Office, Friends, and Workaholics. My favorite food is Chinese, um, also sushi. I love Asian food, clearly. I have two different color eyes. I mentioned this in my other Facts About Me video. I have one hazel eye and one brown eye. I always forget which one is which, but I think this is the hazel one and that's the brown one. I have two tattoos, one on my ring finger, which is a heart, and, and I have one on my forearm. It says Faith, because that's my middle name. And both of them were done by my friend Romeo Lacoste. He's an amazing tattoo artist. And yeah, check him out. My favorite holiday is Halloween. I love Christmas to death, but I love being able to dress up, hence how I was cosplaying in middle school. I've always loved dressing up and just being someone else or something other than myself, so yeah, Halloween is the shiz. I am right-handed. I was diagnosed with anxiety and depression by my psychologist, but I'm trying not to let it define me because I am so much more than my mental illness. A couple of places that I really want to travel to are Japan, Thailand, and Greece. An instrument I really want to learn how to play is piano. One of my biggest passions is singing, even though I don't think I'm the best singer. I get attached to people way too easily. I have an addictive personality, meaning um, I'm easily addicted to things, whether it's food, people, etc. My favorite color is yellow, hence why I'm wearing it. <laughs> One thing that I can't live without is music. I love music with all my heart. I listen to music every day. I want to make music. I've pretty much been obsessed with music since I was a kid. I am currently single and I've never been in a relationship before. My happy place is the gym. I love working out. The reason it's my happy place is because you can only get healthier, you can only get stronger and that's what I love about it. My absolute worst fear is getting kidnapped. I've seen way too many movies about kidnappings and it happens all over the world, whether it's sex trafficking, all of that kind of stuff, and it's honestly terrifying to me, which is why I'm scared of parking garages. I've always wanted to go on a reality TV show or a game show, like Family Feud, Wipeout, Fear Factor, The Bachelor, oh, and Big Brother, which actually I was on an episode of Big Brother. It was an internet episode and I had to leave early, unfortunately, so I left in the middle of the episode, but I was on it and it was a great experience and I'd love to go back. I was a cheerleader in high school. Um, if I can find any pictures, I'll insert them here. Yeah, I was a cheerleader all four years of high school and it was one of the best experiences ever. I've had eight pets throughout my life. Um, three of them were bunnies, Snowball, Pepper, and Bun Bun. I had a guinea pig named Ruby, a bird named Jendi, my dog Sonia, which I love to death, and she passed away a few months ago and it broke my heart. My current pet Luna, who's a cat, and I did have a mouse once, and her name was Cowbell. My favorite song right now is Tequila Wine by Olivia O'Brien. 
You may have heard of her, teen pop sensation, living legend. My favorite musical artists are Black Bear and SZA. My musical inspo growing up was Gwen Stefani and Christina Aguilera. In middle school, I was in both talent shows for my seventh grade year and my eighth grade year. Seventh grade year, I danced with my friend, and my eighth grade year, I sang Ain't No Other Man by Christina Aguilera. <laughs> my nickname in middle school, I didn't really ever have a nickname other than this one kid, Jerome, who used to tease me and he'd always call me Hannah Montana and actually at my eighth grade talent show when I was singing on stage he screamed from the crowd I love you Hannah Montana and that just I'll never forget it. One language that I really want to learn is French. A lot of you may know this but my big break on social media was on Vine. RIP. My shoe size is six and a half. I'm five six and a half. My favorite thing to drink is water believe it or not. I don't drink soda that often and I find that most juices are just sugar so I pretty much stick to water or Arizona. I love Arizona tea. I love the mango flavor. My favorite book of all time is The Phantom Toll Booth. It's basic but it was one of my favorite books as a kid because it just really made my imagination run wild and I love that about it. It honestly really made me appreciate reading. My favorite snack is Hot Cheetos. I love eating them like in my sandwiches. I don't know if that's weird. I'm sure a lot of other people do it but yeah, that's my favorite snack. I want to learn how to produce music and DJ. My favorite movie of all time is Legally Blonde with Reese Witherspoon. And my celebrity lookalikes, this isn't what I personally think, just what I've been told, are Anna Kendrick, you probably know her from Pitch Perfect, and Kristen Stewart from Twilight. If I could have dinner with any celebrity, like basically anyone ever, it would probably be Miley Cyrus. A lot of people are probably gonna think I'm stupid for saying that, or crazy, whatever, it's my opinion. I absolutely love Miley Cyrus. Um, my nickname was Hannah Montana. I loved the show Hannah Montana. She is the founder of the Happy Hippie Foundation, which is an amazing organization. I went to her bangers tour and I got VIP because I love her so much, but I had an amazing time and she's an amazing performer, so. I would love to have dinner with you, Miley Cyrus, if you ever see this. I don't know my father. I was raised by my mom and my grandparents. I'm not a fan of chocolate, but I am a huge fan of sour candy. I have a huge scar on my knee from a skateboarding accident that I had in high school. I don't know if you guys can see it, but it's right here. I started YouTube in 2012. My favorite place to eat is Super Taqueria. It's a Mexican food chain that they have around the Bay Area, so if you're ever down here, definitely check out Super Zacaria. And my final fact is, I lived in Los Angeles for two years, but I no longer live there. I said that in my last video. I live in San Jose, my hometown now. So that is 50 facts about me. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you don't already. And I will see you guys next time that I post a video. Bye! <laughs> Pour tequila in my wine, now I'm feeling fine I wanna waste your time like you wasted mine You walk into the party, I see you in my peripheral Trying not to stare at you is motherfucking difficult